Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Marvin again, back with some more music reactions. <laughs> Welcome back to Smitty Reacts. Now, on this video, we're going to be checking out some music from Goose and Trey Anastasio from Fish. They're doing a collaboration on this song, and I'm definitely here to check it out. Um, I really do like when um, more, uh, how do you want to say it? I don't want to say established bands, per se, or anything like that, but bands that are like, really popular i like seeing them cross over and collaborate because it just kind of shows that they respect each other they both expect um respect their genre of music and honestly it's all about the music when it's all said and done right they just want to see their type of music kind of being pushed forward and, and be more progressive as it were so i'm definitely look, looking forward to kind of checking out and see how these guys work together and how the bands as a sense kind of kind of work together so with that being said too also if you guys caught my coat my post on the community page today um goose is actually um i think it's around october i think it, if i remember right it's coming to close to me in my area so i'm gonna do what i can to make sure that i hit that show um i've got a couple of goose videos up here already i've got a lot more fish videos up on here but if you haven't seen any of them definitely take your time to kind of check my playlist and stuff here on the channel and uh, you'll kind of see what i've been up to on both bands but i want to dive a little deeper into goose um honestly because I've already done a lot for, um, I've already done pretty heavy into fish. Not done by any means. Trust me. There's a lot more coming, <laughs> you know. But at the same time, I kind of want to dive into Goose and Billy Strings and some of those other kind of uh, bands as well. And just kind of broaden my musical horizons, as it were. So, at any rate, before I start in this thing, a couple of housekeeping things for the channel. Um, first and foremost, I do like to talk and pause, do my videos, just to put that out there, you know, just for you guys that don't like that kind of thing. Um, if you guys aren't a fan of that, I, I get it. I respect it. So what I'll do for you is I'll put a link to this video down in the description box below. Go ahead and click on it. That way you can watch this video all the way through without me talking all over it and such. <laughs> and um, of course, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? It helps my little channel grow over here as well. So without too much more talking, let me go ahead and just drop into this video. This is Goose with Trey, Goose with Trey Anastasio. Um, I believe it's called Loose Ends. Or is this two songs, like Drip Filled and Loose Ends? Let's find out. Let's go. Ooh. This is that cool countdown music. the glow sticks. I see him. <laughs> okay. here for a second i'm just looking at the band set up here right here so you have um looks like the uh, drummer over here you got percussionist also in the in the top back then i believe that's uh maybe that's bass player and then like rhythm and lead guitars is, is kind of looking at the, the setup here could be wrong i might change that as we go along but really looking at the, the setup here and then also I, I wonder who else who's on lights who's controlling the lights back there is C, did CK secretly sneak, sneak in there with those guys? I'm just kind of curious. I I probably, my guess would be probably not, but really cool if you happen to sneak in there at some point. Anyway, let's go in there. Oh, we got somebody else on the stage.
right here. First and foremost, I mean, I love the atmosphere that they've created here. Like you have the, the, the lighting changing up, you know what I'm saying? You got your purples and your greens and, you know, reds and such like that. You know what I'm saying? The purple, like really honest, honestly, is a very calming effect, you know, on a crowd and an audience, you know. And then you also have like the groove they're, they're kind of settled into here, just kind of jamming it out a little bit, you know. But I'm also seeing, I, I just realized that there's a piano over here on the right, uh, or to my right, I should say, you know, and like, you know, you have all these different ways to layer into this song. You know what I'm saying? You got somebody that could be on keys. You got somebody over here on bass, you know, a couple of, like, what, a couple of different guitars, percussions, the whole thing. So I know it's probably about to be uh, uh, groovy here in a minute, <laughs> you know, and groove in a good way. You know what I'm saying? Just kind of being able to groove and have like a good little progressive beat here. So I'm assuming this is called Drip Filled uh, is the first part of the song here. Uh, but I'm assuming at some point they're going to transition. I just noticed the runtime on this video is like 21 video, 21 minutes. <laughs> so I'm sure there's going to be some transitions as we go along here and stuff. But the holding pattern they're in right now, like the really cool groove so far, digging it. So I'm going to rewind just a hair and uh, we'll go back in. I definitely like the choice of effects, different guitar effects and sounds. It's really cool. right there i like that lyric right there that was tough that was tough right there he said why you got to be such a soldier all the time you know what i'm saying and then he let that re let it kind of fade out to why you got to be such a soul you know like the way the way he carried the, the the note on that smart really smart right there i like that really cool you know uh uh vocal choice and, and even songwriting choice if that was written in that way really cool but uh yo so far right here, man, this song is great. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you, man. Let me rewind just a little bit. But this guy's voice, when he came in and he start, starts hitting those upper notes, the higher notes and stuff like that, you really appreciate this guy's voice. Like, he's a, he sounds like a very versatile vocalist. And this is the kind of guy you want on your team. Like if, you, if you're creating a band and such like that and getting your, your you know, your sound pieces in order and you want, like, a good, you know, so, a, a good versatile singer, like the more versatile your singer is, the more range of music you can accomplish and different genres, genres of music you can accomplish. You know, we can hit high notes and mid notes and low notes like that's really the sign of a really cool, flexible band. So anyway, sorry, let me go back a little bit. We'll, we'll hop back in there. Let's get it.
Here we go. Get all three of them. Okay, I see you. you Get the round going. <laughs> pause here for a moment so here's my thought and and correct me if i'm wrong please these guys are all pretty nice guys right you know they don't want to step on anybody's toes they want to make sure everybody gets their shine and moment the the challenge with that i think sometimes especially for nice musicians that really want to like do that kind of thing i know somebody's probably going to take off and hopefully kind of solo it out or whatever. But it's like, sometimes you just got to pick a captain, but like, yo, bro, you go first. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No, I know they're both looking at Trey like Trey. Man, look, you're the OG. You the one that's, that really inspired us to be here. Why don't you go ahead and take a lead on this? And Trey's like, look here, bro. I'm in your band <laughs> right now. Like, I want you guys to make the most of the moment of me being here. You know, like, I understand, you know, whatever, whatever. But at the same time, I'm just a musician, too. I'm learning. I'm a journeyman. I'm just like the rest of you guys. And really, since you're in your band, why don't you guys go and take off? So I think it's that cool little dynamic here. I might be overthinking. I could be overthinking it. I, I'm a professional overthinker, by the way. But I, I think it's like somebody's like, what's his solo song? I'm like, somebody's going to go on the, and, and rip the solo. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> but anyway, let me rewind this a little bit. But just saying, though, like the fact that all three of them kind of sitting there together, you know, kind of all jamming out right there. And then they hit that round together. I think that was really cool. And, and a really cool, like, audio, um, like, sonically anyway, was a really cool choice as far as, like, just taking time to go on around it and stuff like that. And then I think they're about to jump off into some stuff here. That's my prediction. Anyway, we'll see. Eight minutes in, I'm sure there's going to be some more stuff coming up here in the next ten minutes or so. So let's get it. Here we go, here we get that. Sorry, I think. Lost my water. They're probably building up to the solos. Okay, maybe I'm overthinking it. There we go. Subtle build, okay. Oh man, excited. Uh... 
Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I like that. For a second, they grooving. I like the way that uh Trey like um you know accents his his soloing right here, right here. He's just throwing with the the accents. You know what I'm saying? It's like if you're in rap and hip hop, you got the little ad lab guy coming in like yeah, cheer, 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 cheer. You know what I'm saying? And you got the guy over here freestyling and going in like that's kind of like the dynamic they got going on right now. <laughs> so anyway, sorry to pause right there. I, I should apologize right there, but yo, I definitely appreciate this this um. You know what I'm saying? Accompaniment right there. Plus, the band themselves as a whole is just groovy, man. They really dropping out some really good licks, you know, really good tunes. I'm, I'm falling into the groove, you know what I'm saying? Makes me want to, like, try to try to freestyle just a little bit, you know. Not rap freestyle, but just kind of hum along freestyle, little vocal stuff, you know. But I like it, little little vocal riffing there. But, man, these guys are really doing anything. All right, we rewind just a little bit. My apologies. Let's get back in it. <laughs> right there yeah get a tray here the piano man over there piano man getting it Uh-huh. 
Yeah. <laughs> and that, that's what was in right there. Okay. Okay, okay, bro. right here because they they in that holding pattern right now man i'm assuming this is loose ends <laughs> at this point but yo like i just like the way that they're just letting this ride and just build that energy and it's a really kind of in a way a slow tension kind of build you know but that way you kind of build up to the ending but you get these nice little peaks and these little cool little spikes that bah, bah, just kind of like pierce and penetrate it between the groove you know and it's a really good standout kind of kind of um how i want to say it writing is the way that i can describe it uh, or what I think some people call it like disruptive writing or disruptive sounds where you kind of like interject sounds like, bah, bah, you know what I'm saying? In between the groove and stuff like, but it's a really cool, like, uh, you know, I don't want to say it. It is just a really cool sound, I guess you could say, <laughs> but definitely enjoy what I'm hearing right here. Also want to take a moment to pause and um, just kind of thank the band again. Cause you got two drummers over here with, two, I didn't realize the guy had a full kit on each side. Like that's crazy. You know, they're really being cool like that, just having extra percussionists in there. Um, I heard my guy over here on the piano holding it down. I wish they had show a little bit more footage of him, but I get it. Like, the person is, like, focused in on, you know, on Trey. And um, and forgive me, because I'm not – here's the problem, man. Here's the problem. I am a, a fledgling Goose fan. <laughs> What's a baby Goose called? I can't remember. But anyway, like, I don't know dude's name. Please don't at me in the comments. Help me in the comments. Please let me know my man's name over here. Uh, but at any rate, like just seeing the, them kind of do their thing is 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 crazy. It really is. It's really crazy. So, all right, less talky, more listening. Let's go. <laughs> Getting it, man. Come on now. My man getting it. Get it, bro. Lazy Lightning 55. Thank you, bro.
tempo switch. Okay. There we go. Smooth it out, don't smooth it out, don't smooth it out, don't smooth it out, don't smooth it out. <laughs> here for a moment yeah i'm that annoying friend next to you that's gonna be like ad-libbing and riffing on the songs that i'm hearing if i'm at the show with you i'm just gonna let you know straight up and down like i go to shows that have fun right so if you hear me over here like you know riffing out or whatever like jamming out like hey 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 look i bought a ticket just like you did just saying <laughs> but at the same time man you know so i am respectful i'm not gonna be that annoying person overly annoying if, I, if you ain't if you ain't feeling it i'm like all right cool long story short though man these goos they killing it we only got a couple more minutes left on this song i'm gonna rewind just a little bit let it just ride out but this is just a, a really cool jam right here man really good stuff loose ends is what this one's called i like it it's fitting to end like probably a set like this too on a song called loose ends really cool all right let me let me let this thing ride out let's go Goes in the back, the congas killing it. All right, here we go. He's about to drive it up. Deep big deep. Hey, really good stuff right there. Really cool, man. All right, let me pause it right there a little bit. And uh, matter of fact, let me get a nice little thing here for the screenshot. Something along those lines. Anyway, I thought this was a really cool moment right here. Just having all three of, of them up here on stage. So, at any rate, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> Give it up for, for Goose and Trey, man. I mean, come on. Come on. How can you not like that? That was just a really cool moment, you know, just seeing Trey on stage with these guys right here. 
who are obviously everybody's just happy to be there and happy to perform with each other, you know, and um, I enjoyed it. You know, like this is honestly for I, I, here's the thing. Like, I, I didn't this is my first time listening to the song, but I'm in a lot of different fish groups at this point in time. Right. Like to a couple different ones. And I remember like um, while this was broadcasting, I immediately avoided it because I know I wanted to save it for the channel. But I, I was able to mute it and like, let's read through some of the comments. And uh, I know that the comments on the internet are like the worst things to read. It just, they are, you know, and there's a lot of back and forth, like somebody's trying to pass the torch and they're not passing this and, you know, uh, Trey's too good for that. And they're not good enough and blah, blah, blah. You're like all this malarkey. But at the end of the day, I said malarkey, but at the end of the day, <laughs> it's good for music. You know what I'm saying? It's good for, for music. It's bringing generations of fans together you know what i'm saying so you got fans all over the place you got probably younger fans that are more familiar with goose that may not be up on fish like that and you may have some fish heads out there that don't really care about anybody else but their favorite band and even then they're critical of their favorite band because they may don't, they don't play what they want them to play when they want them to play you know what I'm saying some entitlement type stuff you know so it's to me it's it's a really cool fusion of of stuff and it's really crossover opportunity you know a fan base is to really be involved with the music because that's at the end of the day that's what the both bands are about. They're about sharing the message, sharing entertainment, sharing positive energy, you know, a, a, a around, you know, a, a universal language, which is music, right? You know what I'm saying? It's easy to story tell, easy for people to fall into. That's why I'm here. Shoot. If, you know what I'm saying? If I didn't like music, I wouldn't be here listening to these guys and appreciating what they really did here. So, you know, long story short, like just appreciate, you know, what we have out here. Really, really just take a moment to appreciate it. So. All right, I'm going to get off my soapbox for a second. <laughs> but that being said, both of these songs, Drip Filled and Loose Ends, were really cool, man. Just really cool groove songs. You know, something that I know you would appreciate more if you were there live and hear it live and stuff like that, you know, along with, like, a live audience setting and so forth. And it's something you can just kind of bop your head to and, and just, you know, enjoy the moment in. So, hey, definitely, definitely an, uh, a fan of that as well. So, at any rate, hey, my name is Marvin. This is Smitty Reacts. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and such. And of course, like, drop me some comments and stuff. If you guys like this stuff, let me know. If you're not a fan of it, let me know too. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's all cool. All opinions are welcome. All voices are welcome. I definitely want to hear from you guys. Um, also, hit my in, uh, my, in, my email. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to say. Um, that's an easy way to to um, send in requests as well as well as my Instagram page. Like, my Instagram is kind of light. I don't have a lot of content up on there. But at the same time, since it's not as enough traffic, messages stand out to me more on there. So if you have any suggestions, like hit me up on it, um, Instagram as well. It's um, Smitty underscore reacts. Um, shoot me an inbox on there or a follow request. And um, you know what I'm saying? Just let me know. Let me know what you want me to check out, and I'll, I'll see if I can jump on that there as well. So, hey, at any rate, my name is Marvin. This is Smitty Reacts. And I'm going to get up out of this video, man. So until the next one, please take care of yourself. Be kind to one another. And, of course, if you guys can do all that, I will catch you in the next video. All right? All right. Peace. Did my video froze?